The Electoral College is an institution that translates the popular vote into an official vote and the election of the president and vice president. That in order to be elected president, you need a numerical majority of the Electoral College vote. A swing state is a state that could go for either of the two major parties. It's winner take all, and so if you win a plurality, you win that state's electoral votes. In these close elections where it could go either way, these few states that are toss-up states end up deciding the result. Candidates make strong efforts in the large population states, and they also make a very strong effort in swing states. There's no sense in investing scarce campaign resources or collecting policy positions that represent the interests of states that you can already count upon. There are some states that I can mention to you right now that we know are almost certainly going to vote for the Republican candidate. And there are other states that we know are almost certainly going to vote for the Democratic candidate. You can't say that about Ohio. Now that's the reason the presidential candidates and the campaigns and the third party organizations are in this state uh, almost all the time. We're certainly one of a small handful of states that is likely to provide the winning margin for whoever the ultimate victor is. There's an old expression that says, as Ohio goes, so goes the nation. And that reflects the fact that the winning presidential candidate, going back many decades, almost always carries the state of Ohio. Ohio is a very diverse state. I call us the heart of America. We are a little bit of everything. We have everything from a very rural county, where agriculture is the livelihood of two large metropolitan centers. In order for a candidate to win statewide in Ohio, they've got to be able to appeal to all of these various constituencies. I think the political competition here is, it can be pretty fierce. Actually, it's really fun um, to live in Ohio during election year. There's a lot of people that are trying to get your attention. Oh, it'll be an exciting time in Ohio on election night. I think people in Ohio feel that it's um, certainly a, a point of pride to be a swing state and, and to say, hey, we make a difference.